The other aspect of my research is to do with cognitive modelling. Cognitive modelling is a, an approach to understanding or producing theories in cognitive psychology. The basic assumption is that thinking is computation. And basically there's a similarity between what's going on in the brain and what, what's going on in computers. So what com cognitive psychologists can do is to produce computer simulations of thinking processes. Mm -hmm. So in, in this situation, here I've built a, a computational model of, 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 of a person or of, of an expert um, understanding the graphs that we've used for our students. Right. So what's going on here is that there's a, there's a computer program that visually scans the graph, takes in information about the graph and, and produces an interpretation like, the, like an expert would. Then, by using this model, we can compare the behaviour of the computational model with the behaviour of the students. And then we can see where the differences are. And in that way, we can make hypotheses about what are the problems, what are the, or the cognitive problems that students are having when they're misinterpreting the graph. There's also a practical application to this model. What we hope to do is to be able to uh, produce a, a, a computer system in which students can put in their own data and it will produce a graph and then they can watch an expert scan the graph or an expert model scan the graph and produce an expert interpretation so they can then learn from that model how to interpret their data or what would be an expert interpretation of their data and not only that the model will explain how it's produced that that interpretation by looking at the visual properties of the graph.